To get the best Madden team, go to instantmaddencoins.com. You can buy players, coins, and training directly to your account. And code MMG is 10% off. Continuing our trend of doing the theme teams. We've got the Pittsburgh Steelers next. I think the Pittsburgh Steelers have to be one of the best fan favorite football teams that exists. Like no matter how good the Steelers are, their fan base believes that they're going to the Super Bowl. And I respect that. You guys have a diehard fan base over there in Pittsburgh. Like Lions fans, bro, we go to Ford Field for fun to watch the other team beat us. And we all just hang out, have a good time. Now that being said, the Pittsburgh Steelers have a pretty nasty theme team. I'm so used to Steelers theme teams having a common theme, which is an insane offensive line. But I think finally the Steelers O-line is starting to fall off a little bit. Ratio plus <laughs> fell off plus every boy better. Granted, you know, EA didn't put in all the Pittsburgh legends this year. But yeah, the O-line's kind of to be desired. Roger Saffold and Kelvin Beecham, it's okay. It's still good. I mean, 97, 94, 95, 92. 91. By the way, I know Baselli did not play for the Steelers. He just gets everybody's chem. You get the 98 overall career tribute, yeah. Ben Roethlisberger. Crazy good card. And I do respect the Big Ben call because you could put in like the boss legend, 98 overall Michael Vick. But like Michael Vick is not an iconic Steelers quarterback. It's Big Ben. We can still get Michael Vick halfback, which is hilarious. I'll probably use Najee a little bit more because it's Najee Harris, but this Mike Vick halfback is actually really good. So it'd be kind of funny. Deontay Johnson. I personally love Deontay Johnson. One of my favorite receivers in the league. Chase Claypool, also a stud. Antonio Brown is an iconic Steelers wide receiver, but his best card this year is only 95, so he's going to have to ride the pine behind Chase Claypool, Deontay Johnson. We also have Plasco Burris, Michigan State University alumni. We got Franco Harris, excellent fullback. Eric Ebron, Pat Fryermuth, who I love. I love Pat Fryermuth. So I'll probably use him a little more than Ebron. Ebron obviously used to play for the Lions. I do not like Eric Ebron at all. I don't care if he's the starter. And that's it for offense. Defense, I am geeked about because these safeties are fucking ridiculous. Troy Palomalu boosted to a 99 overall with Steelers cams. You got Michael Vick corner because EA. It's kind of sick though. I respect it. You got uh, Witherspoon at a 96 for corner three. Mike Hilden up to a 98. Steven Nelson, a 96. Cameron Sutton is a 91 back there. So to be desired, but Minka Fitzpatrick limited at 98. You got Joey Porter, LeVon Kirkland, Devin Bush, TJ Watt. Love the linebackers on this team. You're going to see Jack Youngblood on a lot of these because you can put Jack Youngblood cam on just about every team. So a lot of people do it. Javon Hargrave, me and Joe Green. That's an obvious one. Steelers legend. And uh, 99 overall Melvin Ingram. Yeah, that's going to be absolutely horrifying. That uh, Melvin Ingram is so good. Now, I do want to look at some of these players' stats because they're just so crazy, especially with the theme team cams on. So here's Melvin Ingram. 99 overall, 92 speed, 98 excel, 90 plus on everything else. He's going to be definitely a defensive highlight. The big Ben, 84 speed is actually like a lot faster than you think. 97 throw power is a big highlight on him. And he's got long range, dead eye, gunslinger, and hot rod master. Gunslinger is like essential. This Palomalu, I really hope this is my sub linebacker. 98, so he's got, he would be 95 speed, but he's 98. 98 zone, 97 hit power. And I think he's got pick artist acrobat. Oh, that's gonna be so good. I think Minka is the last one I wanna look at. Oh, cause Minka is gonna be a stud with acrobat. 87 hit power, 98 zone, 97 speed, 97 excel. He's gonna be a stud. All right, boys, 95 overall Steelers theme team in March. I gotta say, it's really impressive. Last time I did theme teams, it was two years ago. And I was doing all the theme teams around, I'd say March. And like some of those theme teams were still like 89, 90, 91 overalls. I'm hoping that Every theme team we use in this series is a 95 plus. Yo, and by the way, actually what? though, a huge shout out to EA for putting the theme team bundles in the store. I don't know if you guys saw this. It's 2200 cash, you gotta pay real money, but I'm pretty sure it's like 20 bucks. You can get a solid theme team with 47 players. Each comes with two 95s or like 95, 94s sometimes. I kind of respect it. Regular season is completely wiped, so I can hop into a full game with the Steelers. I think for theme teams, I am gonna try and play full games every single time as opposed to house rules. I think this makes more sense. Charles Woodson prime time and wow. He's got a squad. I, we're in Lambeau Field and oh, I saw Woodson and Casey Hayward. Maybe it's a Packers theme team. It's a Packers theme team. <laughs> it would be cool if I'm playing a different theme team. But he does have prime time. So did he just ruin it or what? 
So a Steelers theme team versus a Packers theme team. If he has Aaron Rodgers, I'm calling this a Packers theme team and I don't care if it's true. Also, sometimes I'll be on next gen, sometimes I'll be on old gen. Just kind of depends on um whoever's team I'm using. Jalen Hurts? What? What's your team? Oh, it's not a theme team. Damn it. Also got to say a massive thank you to Aiden. Aiden hooked me up with the Steelers theme team. Aiden, you're a stud. Your wiener is an insurmountable size. I've never seen one quite like it. I'm on Melvin Ingram and I shouldn't be, but I might get a lurk anyway. Oh, no. Oh, not that shit. Doesn't matter if I'm on old gen or new gen, I'll still get cover three beatered. I was looking at I was looking at my phone. I was shouting out Aiden this huge wiener, and I got caught on Melvin Ingram. All right, we're gonna hit either Michael Vick or Lynn Swan. That's what I'm thinking. And I can't hit either right now. Playmaker, playmaker, what a ball. Oh, that would have been insanely hard to throw, but it was there. He does have inside stuff, so I'm a little worried. This might not be there, but we're gonna go for it. Hey, Mike Vick! Oh my God! Daylight! I'm so glad we ran it! Sheesh! What do you know? Michael Vick, halfback. I'm sorry, but respectfully, Najee Harris is not that fast in this game. He would not have scored that touchdown. Oh, we dusted him. Nice catch. He just made Charles Woodson look like a bum. That's 99 Charles Woodson. Let's see if he tries to gear up that same play again. I think this is how it usually starts. Yep. Hey, I take that. He wants Devontae, but I'm on it. Oh no, the playmaker. Uh, I'm just gonna take the outside release. I am not good on old gen. Oh, sketchy pass. Joey Porter was there, but not enough. First and 10, he's five for five, 120. They're one all over me. Okay. No, yes! I think that was Minka, was it? Oh, it was Mike Hilton. Dude, if I get a safety, I'm gonna be so depressed. Yes, sir. Great blocks. Great blocks. Mike Vick, three rushes, 87 yards, and a touchdown. I'm gonna stick to this inside zone, bro. It's kind of killing it. Especially when we get that block on Hendricks right there. Ooh. Damn it. Got to be fast. It's fourth and one. What the fuck is that? Are you kidding? Can't even snap? Decent tackle, but not the world's greatest. Not a run play. I expected a run. Mine! Bum. Bum! You're a bum! Worked by Kirkland! Let's go, baby! I could go up big right here. Go up by nine points. He would need two. And I throw it right over his head right there. Oh my god, Michael Vick. This halfback Michael Vick is a monster. That dive was glitchy. 16 to 7. Steelers are putting on a show here. I'm gonna do what he's been doing to me. I'm gonna I'm gonna blitz five and then I'm gonna scream in by myself. See if I can get on Jalen Hurts. Ah shit. I'm not as good as him. Hey! It worked though. If he runs this ball, get a million yards. Oh sh <gasps> Mean Joe Green. I feel so bad. I, I put everybody in pass, bro, even my D lineman. But Mean Joe Green made the play all himself. Oh, he does it again, but I'm dead. I promise you I didn't do that on purpose. I just fucking missed. Oh my god. <laughs> Shit! I know I am dicking around. Mike Hilton with the X-Factor little jump that shit like no other. Uh-oh, 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 uh-oh. Shit. Oh, I can get him. Oh, I can't get him. I can go up by nine points here and get the ball half. So this game's, I, I, I think it's a wrap if I score here. I got some time to think about this. Ah. Uh. Oh my god. Wait a second, ladies and gentlemen. I think we got a game on our hands. I didn't expect him to chase that down. We got a game. Oh, he doesn't get this one off. That one was picked off, too. He's too close. You can't throw it from there. <laughs> Fucking lasered him. Oh, no. I gave up. I gave it up. Hey, we get the stuff anyway. Let's go. I'm just going to slowly dot this man up all the way down this field. Ooh, not the catch I really wanted there. Kind of hope they give you a little more than that. That's what you want. Vic with a great juke burns prime time. I don't think he's going to be able to stop this with his current defense. Horrible catch and throw. If you hit him in stride, we're in business there. Look at Vic. Michael Vic is carrying this fucking team. Completely carrying. Where's Najee? Najee's got to be tired. Yup, there he is, baby. Let's hand it off to him. I haven't gotten Najee involved at all. All right, we'll take it, Najee. Really just got to get in the end zone. And it does not have to be flashy. Oh, look at RB! You're homeless! We need you right there. We need you so bad right there, bro. That's like the most crucial catch. Yikes, dude.
Oh no, Ben doesn't get it off. If I lose this game, I, th I think I might deserve it. Old Jen is, is, old Jen is really stupid, if you ask me. That's fucking dumb. Oh, but he'll get it off. All right, that's cool. Oh, he's gonna go with a little handoff. We're there, we're there. Not entirely, but we're there. Oh, a pitch going absolutely nowhere. God, this guy's ass. I'm pissed that I'm even in this position. Ooh, so he takes that one, so I throw Vic. Easy decision. And we'll make the exact same throw. Beautiful. First and 10. Okay. Oh my God. We got Butterfingers right now, boys. There's Lynn Swan right in the middle. Are you fast enough? Are you gonna go? <laughs> Just barely. Hey, the quick score is big right there, though, because I don't think he could chew clock cheese me. It would be over if I wasn't being an idiot, but it's still a good game. There he is. Oh, wow. That's his first really good user play, I'd say. Reads me like a book. It's a five-point game. That's crucial. Five points is crucial here. He scores a touchdown. He's up by two. Yeah, strong close. This is the beater. He's trying to run the thing. So we go with Kirkland and follow him. Just throws a quick one out the backfield. Oh, don't experience network issues right now, buddy. Not the time to do that. Oh, a little run play. Good stop though. Kirkland's there. Uh, it's fine by me. Wow, he got six out of that. What? Get there, Mijo. Mijo Green was right on him and he missed. He's got a good drive going here so far. Gets one out the backfield. Big hit goes nowhere though. He ate that shit. Moving the ball effectively. Now he's chewing clock. I didn't think he'd be able to chew clock cheese me with this much time on the clock, but I think he's gonna be able to. Palomalu can't get there. Big hit. Oh, we're on him. Oh, we're on him! Mijo Green! He's got two of the biggest plays in the game! Second and 27, Jalen Hurts was in trouble early. I'm about to just get on his head. I'm on him! How you like that, boy? That's exactly what he was killing me with, dude. Third and 32, he's gonna come out here in the beater. You can't do it on cover four, right? I have to assume. Lol. What a... Idiot. You can do that against cover four. <laughs> How are they gonna let you do that against cover four? That doesn't even make sense. I like I like next gen a little bit better. I can still win this ball game. I can still win this ball game. He's gotta go for two and get it. I got 47 seconds and two timeouts. No fucking way. No fucking way. Don't tell me! Don't tell me I'm gonna ice you up like that! Don't tell me I'm gonna ice you up like that! Game! Read you like a fucking book! God, these kids are ass in this game! They really let you do this shit? I can't believe they let you cover three beater like that. You cannot do that on next gen, by the way. You cannot throw that shit against cover four on next gen. But he throws a crucial, crucial pick six! Wow! That fucking sucks. I didn't just turn the ball over. He just got a rolling interception. It is still a game. You're so bad! You're so bad! <laughs> no way! Oh my god, bro! I just gave you the fucking ball back! You're gonna throw it right on my face? Dude, the Steelers theme team was one of the best games I played. Ironically, it was one of the worst games I played, but it was also one of the best. 23 to 22, the pick six two-point conversion ices the game for the Steelers. Respectfully, you're gonna have to get good. Dude, it's three touchdowns on a cover three beater. I'm so mad I even made that a game. The greatest play you've ever seen right here, baby. Use your Minka, you read the sit down, you pick that shit off, you dodge fast ass Derrick Henry, and then Randall Cobb just doesn't have the wheels to keep up with you, and you take that shit into the end zone for two points. All right, hey boys, I love ya. Uh, Aiden, thank you for the squad, I appreciate you, bro. And I'll see you boys in the next uh, either Wheel of March theme team. It'll be a good time. Hey, love you boys. Thanks for watching as always. Peace out.